All right, so in this small tutorial, we'll be taking a look at timers. Now, timer is a node that we can add. We can go into the world. We can create a script. And here we go. Now, we're not done, of course. What we can do is in our timer, we can connect the timeout signal. And this is a signal that happens every time the timer finishes. I can print timer as finished. And now the cool part about this is inside of my timer here, I can turn this on auto start, I can hit play. And now every second, it should now say timer is finished. Now another thing I can do is I can start the timer automatically. So I can get the node, get the timer and say dot start on the ready function. Now here after one second, you'll see timer has finished. Now, one shot allows our timer to only happen one time, which is also sometimes something you might need. So here you'll see it happens once, but that's it. It never happens again. Now, another thing that's not exactly a timer. In fact, we can actually delete this timer here. Now, another thing that you might need or could use is a await function. Now, the cool part about this is that I can create a timer through code. I can create a one second timer and then I can wait for the timeout signal. So here, essentially what I'm doing is I'm creating the timer and then waiting for the timeout signal. Now, a wait will stop the code until that timeout or that signal has completed. So here I can say print uh, before timer. And then I can paste this right after and then say after timer. Now, if I hit play, you'll see it says before timer, and then one second later, it'll print after timer. All right, that is it for the timer tutorial or lecture. Um, there's not much to it. It's pretty simple, but that's pretty much most of the things you'll need in terms of timers inside of Godot. So good luck with the rest of the lecture and course. Uh, and I might actually upload this on YouTube as well. So uh, if you're curious about what this course is for. It is for my RTS course. Uh, it might even be for some uh, future courses. So check out my courses down below and I'll see you all in the future.